Here at Canham Consulting, you know, the civil engineering department is relatively new. We've been here about two or three years and we're really here to service some of the, the buildings that, that went on. That was the initial kind of heart, but out of that we've developed very much into our own business group. Um, we uh, have our own projects with regards to sort of largest civil projects which uh, start at the pre-planning world really in terms of flood risk, in terms of traffic and, and those sides of things and then take it through into the design of the access roads, uh, the design of the drainage and all of those things which facilitate the development. We are from the very small right up to the very large. I suppose that would be the, the difference of the civil section if we have that, that larger kind of scheme that we tend to get involved in. And we've probably been using sort of three-dimensional ground modelling work for about 10 years actually in terms of some of the things we can present in terms of the design of roads and certainly in terms of the design of drainage. We, we have three-dimensional software which can model rivers. The future of the, the department is, is very exciting. I think we're looking to expand all the time. We're looking to take people on. Um, the importance of sustainability is really key and core to where we're at. There is a, a move coming up with regards to sustainable drainage. We're very much in the, the middle of it. It's probably the big change that's happened over the last 10 years really in terms of the industry. So I guess the, the changes and the challenges over the next 10 to 15 years probably are as significant as they have been with the Victorian changes. So at Canama we, we feel very assured that we're in exactly the right place that we need to with regards to the challenges ahead. Um, we're right on the edge of technology with regards to BIM. We're making sure that we're, we're making all the right connections and we're understanding the latest policies so that we can apply these over the next 10 years. We pride ourselves on a number of things here in terms of the team that we have. The team that we have is massively experienced. They've been around for a long time. I'm the youngest member of the team. I'd just like to highlight that to anybody watching. So I'm the youngest guy and uh, the team is brilliant. They, they really do have a, a great ethos for understanding the client's need. And I think that's, that's where we come at all projects from. We, we say, right, where, what's the client need here? What's it there? What are they trying to achieve? We know that even at the pre-planning aspect, there's some really important decisions need to be made about what can actually be built. So that experience that we have on actually constructing projects, on seeing this stuff hit the ground, the challenges of getting stuff built is then brought forward back into the planning process so that things which are applied for at that stage can be built, which is great benefit to cost, great benefit to the client in terms of redesign, all of those things which make construction a headache. Uh, we try to manage out and, and make sure that we're not going to do those things.